Hey guys, it's Carrie. Welcome or welcome back. Happy Tuesday. It is about four o'clock in the afternoon here. It is actually beautiful today. We have had, I don't know, maybe you've seen on the news, but Texas, North Texas where I live, the Dallas area, we have been like inundated with rain and flooding and tornadoes. Fortunately, um, no tornadoes have hit where I live. Um, a few days ago though, <clears throat> we did have a terrible storm, um, like with 90 mile an hour winds. Um, a tree actually fell on my son's car. So we've had some yucky weather days, like really yucky. Um, today is actually beautiful. The sun is out, it's warm. So after this video, I am headed down to the pool um, where we live, um, our new place. We actually, I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but we're actually like in this um, apartment community, but it's, it's considered like resort living because I actually do need to do a video for you guys and kind of take y'all on a tour. Um, it is so pretty here. Even though I'm in the middle of like the Dallas area <laughs> where I live, it just feels secluded because it's kind of like hidden off the highway and there's palm trees everywhere. And so they've done a really good job of fixing up their pool. You go out to the pool and you really do feel like you're at a resort. So I'm definitely gonna take advantage of that today <laughs> before another rainy day comes. Um, but I did want to hop on and do a video for y'all. This is actually not a wax video, believe it or not. I really do need to be doing um, some wax videos, but I wanted to take a break from those and show y'all some goodies that I have picked up at Bath & Body Works over the past month, maybe. Um, yeah, I would say I've had some of this stuff sitting for about a month, but I wanted to wait and do the video until I had um, enough stuff to actually, you know, make it worthwhile to do a video. So I have for you guys um, four candles, a ton of room spray, and just some odds and ends. Now, some of this stuff I purchased um, on like a sale day. I know the candles I got... Um, I think two of the candles I got when they were $13.95 and then the other two I got uh, when it was buy one get one free. The room sprays I got um, when they had the room spray sale. Some of this other stuff is like because of my rewards points or you know get a free item. So it's just kind of like a mishmash of stuff as my mom would say. <laughs> so let's just get started. I'm super excited to show y'all what I picked up. We're going to start with the room sprays first. Y'all know how I feel about Bath & Body room sprays. I love them. I'm obsessed with them, but, and there's a very big but, um, they are $8.95, which, you know, just round that up to $9 for a 1.5 ounce room spray. I... I don't want to say I never because I actually have a couple of times paid full price for these, but rarely do I pay the full $8.95 for these things. I just can't justify paying almost nine bucks for not even a two ounce room spray, as good as they are. So 99.999% of the time when I buy these, it's because they're on sale. And Bath & Body, I wouldn't say they put these on sale incredibly often, but they do. I just check my email or check my app, and if I see that they're on sale, most of the time when these go on sale, they put them on sale for like $3.95 or $3.50. So anytime I see that they're on sale, I go and I stock up. So that's what I did. So all of these room sprays came on a room spray sale day. I didn't get a ton. Um, I tried to be good, so I just got six. And, um, let's see, I want to say uh, two of them, yeah, so two of them are repeat um, scents that I've had, and then the other four are brand new. So, um, for the brand new ones, I actually went on the Bath & Body website and jotted down the scent notes um, for you and me both, because I was actually kind of interested in what the scent notes were for some of these. 
Um, okay, so let me show you the two that I've had before. Um, it's summertime, it's hot. I had to go get me a watermelon lemonade. Um, this is just such a classic for summer. I've had it in the candle before. I actually don't have it in the candle yet this summer. I may go and get it, um, but I knew I wanted the room spray. Love watermelon lemonade. And then the other one that I've had before is the strawberry daiquiri. Last summer was my first experience with strawberry daiquiri in the candle, and I loved that candle. In fact, you're gonna see that candle here in just a second. Um, it's just so good. It's not your strawberry pound cake. So if you're looking for strawberry pound cake, you don't want strawberry daiquiri. This to me is nowhere near bakery. Um, this is just fruity and fun and summery. Um, yeah, so it's not strawberry pound cake. It's totally different and that's what I was looking for. I do love strawberry pound cake, but for this hot summer that we are about to get into, I wanted something still with strawberry, yes, but a little bit more fruity and fun. So strawberry daiquiri, so excited. And then these other four are new um, room spray scents for me. Now this one here, this is Fresh Amalfi Lemon. Um, I had this in a candle last year and I really, really, really liked it. You talk about a powerhouse, a strong performer. Who, um, this kind of gives me um, like sweet sugared lemon vibes from Walmart mainstays. Um, this right here though, yeah, there's nothing in this to me at least that leans bakery lemon. This is like straight up cleaner lemon, what you wanna smell on a hot, hot day when you're cleaning your house. Um, or maybe like if you've been cooking and you've been cooking with like garlic or onions and you just need something like super strong to like cover up your smell, that's what this is. And like I did have it in the candle last year. I haven't picked it up in the candle this year. I may. Um, I have some other lemon things though, so I don't really need more lemon candles, but I, I really was excited to pick this up in the room spray. So this fresh amalfi lemon i've had it in the candle so it kind of is a familiar scent but i haven't had it in the room spray so i'm anxious to see how it does in the room spray i think it's going to be a really good one and then these three right here are totally totally brand new scents i think they're brand new for bath and body works um, all together that these are just like brand new for the summertime and i love the packaging on these um, they're just kind of these fun I don't want to call it well maybe like pastel-y colors um, and cute pictures maybe you've seen them in your stores as well um, now the thing is I don't think yeah I don't think these scents are in candles I haven't seen them in candles but I did pick them up in the room sprays so this first one here this green one is vacation vibes and I know that sometimes um, Bath & Body will put the scent notes on their room sprays but these don't so I jotted them down vacation vibes is juicy pineapple sugared coconut golden orange I mean that just screams summer right those fruity notes and these new ones I actually did like test out in the store on the little tester strip and they smelled amazing so picked up vacation vibes and now this one was a little bit of a wild card because it's cherry but um, oh, it's Tropical Cherry Colada. I don't typically do cherry scents. I mean, I definitely don't do cherry in candles. Sometimes I'll do it in wax. Um, but this, uh, the scent notes are bright cherry, whipped coconut, and sandalwood. When I sprayed it in the store on the little strip, um, I actually didn't get a whole lot of cherry. I got a berry note but it came off like more raspberry to me than it did cherry. Now, granted, that was just like on a tester strip, so I don't know how this is gonna do when I spray it, you know, in my entire house, but I will keep you posted. Um, you know, it was on sale, so it's not like I spent the whole $9 for that. And then this last one I'm super excited for 
This is Poolside Cabana, and the scent notes are Tropical Banana, Solar Coconut, Radiant Orange Flower. Yeah, and when I tested this one in the store, I definitely got that banana note, and <clears throat> I am all about the banana in the summertime. So, and I do have some banana candles that I'm anxious to start burning, so super excited for that one. So I will keep y'all posted. Um, you'll definitely see those in an empties when I'm all done with those. Um, but yeah, pretty excited. And the fact that they were on sale is even better. <laughs> okay, so let me do um, my free items and then we will talk about candles. So I don't have a ton of free stuff, but free is free, right? And like, I'm excited. <laughs> Anytime I get something for free at Bath & Body Works, it's a good day. All right, so, oh, actually, you know what? This one here was not free, um, but I know I got this like for super, super cheap. It was on one of their wallflower sale days, and I picked up a watermelon lemonade. I thought this would be just so fun to have in the kitchen. Uh, scent notes are watermelon, ice, sparkling water, and Meyer lemon. I mean, yeah, it's just a classic. So that's gonna go in my kitchen. Uh, okay, now everything else here I did get for free. Um, da, 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 you should not be surprised. I picked up an Into the Night body wash. Um, this is $8.95 and I think on my app it was like for a free item, like $9.95 or cheaper, like in their little, what do they call it? Like their travel size items. I will never get tired of this scent, you guys. It's my fave. Love it. Um, this, yeah, I know I got this for free. Um, this is $14.95. This is the Aromatherapy Eucalyptus Spearmint Stress Relief uh, Oil Mist. And this is because I had on my app a free item up to $16.95. And I actually like wasn't thinking I was gonna go for this. I was thinking I was gonna get something a little different, but I saw this and yeah, I just, I don't know. I haven't had one of these in a while and I love these, I love them. I spray these on my pillows, on my sheets, on my blankets, I mean, on myself. <laughs> yeah, so I'm kinda glad I got this because um, I think if I had not gotten it, I probably would have regretted it, so. Got that for free. And then these two things um, I did get for free as well. So this is, I'm not sure what Bath & Body is calling like this collection, but it's like, I guess it's their new vacation line, I guess. Um, and I heard, I think it was um, here on YouTube, uh, Queen of the Girl Geeks. I don't know if you guys are subscribed to her or watch her, but her name is Bonnie and she is absolutely amazing. I kind of call her like the queen of Bath & Body Works because anytime I need to know like what's going on at Bath & Body, what sale is there, what new scent is there, she's kind of the one I turn to. Um, and so she was calling these kind of like their, their dupes for like the Sol de Janeiro. Um, so... And when you hear the scent notes, I think they are kind of trying to, I don't know if they're going for an exact dupe, but it's very, very similar. Um, so this is Vacation Vibe. Now, at first, I was thinking it was the same as this room spray. It's not. The room spray is Vacation Vibes, and this has like the, the um, coconut, what else did it have? And the pineapple, yeah. So totally different. This is Vacation Vibe, and this is Whipped Pistachio and Amber. So it has that pistachio, I guess maybe kind of mimicking like Brazilian Crush maybe, or the Boom Boom. Um, and this is the body wash. So on the back, they have the scent notes listed as Whipped Pistachio, Sun Drenched Jasmine, and Praline Amber. Um, oh, beautiful yeah I do I feel like this is kind of a little bit of boom boom with a little bit of the Brazilian crush but it does it totally gives me like Sol de Janeiro vibes um, and 
Bath and Body had three. So they had this one, and then they had two others kind of in this line. Um, I smelled the other two. This is the one I liked the most. So I was able to get this for free. And then um, I had another one of those free travel size items. So I got this, uh, the same scent in the Fragrance Mist because I thought I could just pair these two and I would smell amazing. So excited for that. All right, so we are ready for candles now. And I have four. Again, two of them I got on the $13.95 sale, and then the other two I got on buy one, get one free. Okay, so we'll start with these two. These two I got on the $13.95 sale, and I knew exactly which one I was going in for. And you're gonna see the exact same candle in this bag. Um, this is a candle that I think I Oh, when was my first time with this candle? It might have been last summer or the summer before because I haven't um, like burned this candle for a long time. Like I feel like I just recently kind of was introduced to this candle. Y'all, from the first time I burned this, I was obsessed. And I'm kind of sad that this only comes out in the summer because if this came out year round, I would have this year round in my candle collection. Like I'm obsessed, obsessed. It's Summer Boardwalk. Y'all, I love this candle. If you have never experienced Bath & Body Summer Boardwalk, go get you one. <laughs> it's amazing. And I have heard, I'll tell you the scent notes in a second, but I have heard several people on YouTube say that they don't really get summer from this. They get more of like a fall feel. I totally get that because the scent notes are caramel glazed popcorn, warm taffy apples, salty sweet cream. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, it's so good. So I do kind of see what they're talking about because it does lean a little bit like fallish, like maybe end of September, beginning of October with that caramel. Um, I kind of get like kettle corn, like a salty sweet. Oh my gosh, you guys. And then you get the apple. Oh, it's, it's amazing. I mean, it is amazing. Oh my gosh, it's, it's fantastic. Um, okay, I will say, <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this packaging. Um, I do love the Ferris wheel. I mean, you gotta have a Ferris wheel, uh, uh, a Ferris wheel, you know, when you're talking about summer boardwalk, totally get that. But I'm not really sure what's up like with this hot pink. Um, I don't know if these are supposed to be clouds. It's kind of, I don't know, I don't get it. I mean, it's not horrible. For some reason, I think, yeah, this is brand new packaging, but I wanna say it was last year or year before, the packaging was super, super, super cute. This one is not a favorite of mine. I mean, I don't despise it, but the hot pink is just kinda of like throwing me off a little bit. Um, but the scent, you guys. Oh. This, I would say aside from pumpkin pecan waffles and Paris Cafe, <laughs> I would say that this, is one of the strongest candles Bath & Body like ever puts out. It is so, so, so good, so strong, y'all. And these have been sitting here for a while, so I've been like, I gotta do a video, I gotta do a video so I can start burning this candle. Oh, it's fantastic. I mean, oh my gosh, I will never get tired of this. I'm absolutely obsessed. Um, and you know, I love to pair my candles with my wax. I say that all the time. So this candle is so versatile because you can put in like caramel scented wax. You can put in apple scented wax. I mean, it's so good. It's so good. And I can totally see what people are saying when they say they wait until later in the summer or early fall to do this. And I might, but I honestly don't think that <laughs> these are gonna make it that long because I I just love it like I can't stop burning this it's just so good 
It's so good. So that's what this bag was here. I got two of Summer Boardwalk. Love it. Let me know in the comments if you're as obsessed with that candle as I am. It's just fantastic. All right, and then last bag. I have two candles in here, and these I got on the buy one, get one free that they had a week or so ago. Um, one of them is a repeat for me, and the other one is brand new. Let me show you my repeat first. Da, 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 da. Strawberry daiquiri. Last summer was my first time with this candle, and I loved it. I, I mean, I'm tempted to say, and I... I'm kind of hesitant to say this because I do love strawberry pound cake. Like, who doesn't love strawberry pound cake? But I might, I don't know. There's a slight chance that I might like this one better. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. Ooh, it's so good. Scent notes. Frozen strawberries, sweet simple syrup, shot of tropical rum, zesty citrus twist. Yeah, it, it's just so good. Sometimes... Sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes strawberry pound cake for me can just get like too much. Like it's too, it's too like strawberry cakey. I don't know. Not all the time, but there's sometimes when I just kind of reach my limit for strawberry pound cake. Um, but this one, yeah, this one is a little bit lighter. Sometimes that's it. Sometimes I feel like strawberry pound cake can just be real heavy and real dense. Um, which is not a bad thing, but this one is a lot lighter. It's a lot fruitier. It's it's just fun. It's, yeah, it's citrusy. It's just so good. And the throw on this thing is amazing. Now, this packaging is brand new, and I actually do love this packaging a lot. A lot with the wraparound label. It's so pretty. Um, and it has kind of lid. I didn't show you the summer boardwalk, sorry. Um, yeah, the lids are actually pretty. Um, now, the strawberry daiquiri I had last year was a wonderful performer. I'm kind of hoping that this year's version is going to be just as good because last year I was absolutely just blown away. So, love strawberry daiquiri. And then this last one here, um, this is a brand new to me scent. This is... Um, I don't know, I guess it's part of their summer collection or their vacation collection because um, the packaging on the one I'm about to show you is similar to this summer boardwalk. Now this is one that, again, Bonnie, Queen of the Girl Geeks, I heard her review and then I've seen a few other people talk about this one on YouTube and the reviews have been amazing. When I smelled it in the store, I, okay, so funny story. This candle that I'm about to show you, I smelled in the store like when it first came out and I was like, oh, you know what? That's okay. It's nice. And then I didn't get it. But then I kept like watching reviews on it. And then every time I'd go back in the store, I would smell it again. And I would be like, I, I really like that. <laughs> I really like that. Um, so I got me one. It's under the sun. The packaging is you know, kind of simple, but it's actually really cute with the wrap around and this, I guess this is supposed to like mimic sand and there's your little beach umbrella or a beach ball. I'm not sure. It's really cute. The scent notes for this are sweet coconut, sunny banana, warm jasmine. Yeah, it's, it's so good. So what this reminds me of, oh, and it's, it's really pretty. I mean, it's, I don't know if you can kind of make it out through the phone, but it's it's like the palest, I can't really tell if it's supposed to be green or blue, but it's like the palest aqua. We'll call it aqua. Kind of to match this. It's really, really pretty. So what I get from this, just like on cold sniff, is I get like if you had banana scented sunscreen. <laughs> so this is amazing because I get the banana, but this is not bakery banana. This is like summertime tropical banana. If you had banana scented sunscreen, that's the best way I can put it. So this is perfect for this time of year. Yeah, and you know, I love banana and I'm happy because I feel like I have kind of my 
my whole spectrum of banana covered because in my collection of wax, I've got lots of banana scented wax. I've got bakery banana. I've got this kind of more like tropical banana. And then I also have um, several banana candles that I can choose from as well. So I have my Main Street Bakery, um, which is more of a bakery banana. And then this one, you definitely get the banana in here. But this, yeah, not bakery banana at all. This is sunscreen, tropical, banana scented sunscreen. <laughs> Maybe that's something like we could market, you know, like get on Shark Tank and market some banana scented sunscreen because this is fantastic. This is something I would want to smell on a day that, you know, you've like we've been to the beach or we've been to the pool. Oh, it's just so good. So, so glad I, I went for this because this is one I've kind of been back and forth debating on. But then when I saw all those awesome reviews, I was like, let's try it. So let me know in the comments if you have this, if you've burned it, does it smell as good as it does on cold? I'm really excited for this one. So that was Under the Sun. And that is my small but mighty Bath & Body Works haul from the past few weeks that I wanted to share with you guys. So now I can start using some of this stuff. <laughs> and as always, you will see it in an empties when it is all used up. Thank you guys so much for clicking on and spending some of your Tuesday with me. Uh, I am off to the pool, so you guys have a great rest of your day and a wonderful evening. I want to say thank you to my subscribers. Um, that is for you. I love and appreciate you. Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. And if you are not already a part of Curious Collections, I would love for you to hit the like and the subscribe and leave me a comment. I would love to have you um, as part of Curious Collections. Thank you guys. I can't believe Curry did not make an appearance one time. Yay. <laughs> Y'all have a great day and I'll see you soon for another video. Bye.